Welcome back. Airport Authority of India demolished encroached compound walls of three houses in Dabali as a part of expansion of Dabali Airport on Friday. Demolition was carried following government orders. Airport Authority has plans to use this space for utility services and for parking. Airport Authority of India demolished encroached compound walls in the airport area on Wednesday. Authority demolished it following government's orders. Airport Authority is planning for utility services in 20,000 square meters of land acquired by the AAI. The demolition action was limited to compound walls and not the houses. The collector has given the direction that building houses where they reside in residential places should be maintained as it is, as it is, as it is, and other structures should be demolished, and so that. Out of 20,000 20, 20, square meter, balance area, water area is available. That will be ended over the accounts department, that is the PWD. The demolition was carried out in presence of Special Land Acquisition Officer for Airport, Joint Mamlatar of Murgaon, Police and PWD officials. A reporter from Vasco, Surendra Madkaikar. Purumantache Fest has yet again been caught in controversy. This time, not for traffic congestion, but the fees collected by the Madagao municipality from the stall owners. Each stall owner has paid a different amount to the municipality. Stall owners claim that the municipality has not given them any receipt. However, Madagao municipality has refused the claim. This confusion has become a regular affair at the annual Purmentache Fest in Margao. Each stall owner has been charged differently by the municipality. Moreover, they have not been given any receipts. Surprised? But here are a few who do possess a receipt. That stall owner has paid 1,250 rupees. We spoke with Chief Officer J.B. Bengi. He says allegations are baseless. But all of the allegations are baseless. Uh, basically, I have seen that my people, they, uh, they have taken care to give the stalls as per the practice and they have uh, taken the receipts from them. The whatever allegations comes as uh, the, uh, the money is being taken, uh, no complaint has been received to me so far. A reporter from Margao, Savio Dais. And now let's have a look at the other events in the state. The renovated 50-bed private ward and 12-bed casualty ward of the Goa Medical College and Hospital at Bamboli was inaugurated by the Chief Minister Manohar Parikar on Wednesday. The upgraded emergency operation theatre block at GMC was also inaugurated. He was accompanied by Health Minister Lakshmi Khan Parsekar, Santandre MLA Vishnu Surya Vag, Dr. Pradeep Naik, Dr. Rajan Kuklekar, Medical Superintendent Sanjeet Rodericks and other senior doctors. And kin pass operation theater Jachat Burpoda the He, Barani Path Sutra operation theaters. Tamil and Equira operations G. Dili Hutat, postpone Hutat, the Jantela Virat, Virit service in a Sangla Padel. Speaker of Goa Assembly and Pedne MLA Rajendra Arlekar inaugurated widening and hot mixing of road at Korgaon. Punch members Sarpanch Pandhari Arolkar and others were present. Sadaran Pane, there was a don kotiche, a kamasa, Ekshe Anshi Disani, Pausaki this Darun, Ekshe Anshi Disani, Kamsaka Puruna of Bagzai. A book in Portuguese by father, Enfemiano Miranda, was released by renowned writer Damodar Mauzo in. Margao. The book highlights social history of Goa. The title of my book is Oriente e Ocidente na Literatura Goesa. Realidade, Ficção, História, uh, Mitos. A subtitle to that. A sum up of all our conditions, social, historical conditions against which this literature was born. Bureau report.
Prudent Media. Don't worry if you have missed this bulletin. Log on to www.prudentmedia.in or you can also catch latest updates on Twitter by following us at Prudent Goa. Meet us on Facebook at www.facebook.com slash prudentmedia. And with this we come to an end of this news bulletin. Keep watching Prudent Media. Goodbye.